So, Sipu Sisu, which is you? You, how's it going? Right, so we, we just need to tackle something. Okay. Um, I think, Dave, you should explain this because you're in the business. Yeah, you know, when in the entertainment business, we are normally running on a, on a very specific basis of where we're supposed to be, what time we're supposed to be there. We have a set time, we play from this time to that time. You know, and some guys have contracts, they'll break it down by minutes. You don't perform for two hours, you perform for 120 minutes. Because if you're one minute over or one minute short, they can find you and that's how it's going to work, unfortunately. And today, unfortunately, you were late. So it really puts us in a situation where, you know, in this business, if you're late for a set, you're never going to get booked again for that event for, for that promoter. So, yeah. so not just late, like two hours late. So the call time was 9 o'clock. It was 11 o'clock that you rocked up. And it can't be done. By that time, your set is over. It's, it's finished and done. Yeah. We are we, we running a, a shoot here. You've got to actually be within your scheduled time. Mm -hmm. and, and it's not respectful to the other guys who are here on time to show up two hours later. The thing is, the traffic, I know. there are corps everywhere. So Everyone has the same, unfortunately. We've all got traffic problems. And, uh, and that's, so because of that, and I hope you'll take this away with you, something that you're going mm -hmm. to learn and you won't forget, uh -huh. is that you're going to be disqualified from this round and you automatically go through. Okay. Unfortunately, I'm sorry about that, but that's unfortunately the way the business is. Eh? If you're late for a set, that's it. You're done for a time.